14 Traits of Normal Christian Spirituality Compiled by Dr. Galen Curra The following traits typically mark the life and experience of mature Christian believers. 1. Cosmic Myth they interpret the meaning of their life and of political events by the conflict between God and lesser spirits. Indeed there are many gods and many lords, yet for us there is one God, the Father, from whom are all things and for whom we exist. 2. Confession of Faith they believe and confess that Jesus is the Lord. If you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. 3. A Sacred Bath By accepting baptism, they identify themselves before God before angels and before men, with Jesus Christ, for time and eternity. Baptism now saves you as an appeal to God for a good conscience, through the resurrection of Jesus Christ, who has gone into heaven and is at the right hand of God, with angels, authorities, and powers having been subjected to him. 4. A Sacral Meal By an act of symbolic cannibalism, they often remind themselves of Jesus' crucifixion as a divine sacrifice. Jesus said, This is my body, which is for you. Do this in remembrance of me. This cup is the new covenant in my blood. Do this, as often as you drink it, in remembrance of me. 5. Unity with Christ They consider themselves spiritually joined with Jesus as a bride with her groom, participating in his eternal life. We were buried therefore with him by baptism into death, in order that, just as Christ was raised from the dead by the glory of the Father, we too might walk in newness of life. 6. Prayers and Replies They enjoy communication with God, formulating requests and receiving answers for their own needs and to help others. When you pray, go into your room and shut the door and pray to your Father who is in secret. And your Father who sees in secret will reward you. 7. Life in the Holy Spirit They receive supernatural ability to love and to serve others and to maintain self-control. The fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control. As each has received a gift, use it to serve one another. 8. Dead to Sin, Alive to God They lead a new life of fellowship with God that proves stronger than their former destructive behavior and disbelief. If we have died with Christ, we believe that we will also live with Him. So you also must consider yourselves dead to sin and alive to God in Christ Jesus. 9. Prophetic Utterance God reveals messages to them that they share with each other for their mutual edification and encouragement. Earnestly desire the spiritual gifts. The one who prophesies speaks to people for their upbuilding and encouragement and consolation. 10. Generous Thanksgiving they feel gratitude towards God and to others for all that they enjoy. For everything created by God is good, 
and nothing is to be rejected if it is received with thanksgiving, for it is made holy by the word of God in prayer. 11. Dreams and Visions God sometimes warns them of danger or guides them by images or words inside their mind. The Lord said to Paul one night in a vision, Do not be afraid, but go on speaking and do not be silent, for I am with you. 12. Signs and Wonders God often allows them to heal diseases, to expel evil spirits, or to find help in amazing ways. Does he who supplies the Spirit to you and works miracles among you do so by works of the law, or by hearing with faith? 13. Joy and Inner Peace they enjoy an inner calm in spite of their personal problems. These things I have spoken to you, that my joy may be in you, and that your joy may be full. I have said these things to you, that in me you may have peace. 14. Endurance and Martyrdom Following the example of Jesus, they remain willing to suffer the loss of life or property. You will be hated by all for my name's sake, but the one who endures to the end will be saved. These experiences and others like them await all who embrace Jesus as Lord.